Okay. Uh, second bit of news, I got this from a very trusted friend of mine who's a doctor, and it's been copied to uh, literally dozens and dozens of doctors, and it reads as follows. Uh, I confirm the info below with my cousin Arash, who is the director of pulmonary department at the Harvard Medical School and Hospital. He has been treating COVID-19 patients in ICU for the past two weeks and validated the accuracy of this information. Please send this to as many people as you can. This information might save lives. Stay home well and safe. And this is from a friend of mine who I've known for years, so I have absolutely no doubt that this is the straight deal. Uh, Information from Vienna's laboratory studying COVID-19 say vast majority of people who died had ibuprofen Advil in their system. Do not take it. Those who recovered did not take ibuprofen. So if you have symptoms, take paracetamol, acetaminophen, Tylenol only. It looks like this virus thrives on ibuprofen, so don't do it and tell everyone you can. Mm -hmm. Please pass this information on to everyone in your family, each family. I don't want to miss anyone, so share as much as you can or copy and paste. I just spoke with my friend who was a nurse at, uh, in Vancouver, and they just learned that Advil makes the virus 10 times worse. Oh, wow. Tylenol only for the time being. She said Advil kickstarts the virus into pneumonia. She also said they are not releasing the correct number of cases on the news, and they have patients coming in every day, some currently on ventilators. Soon they won't have enough room in the hospitals to treat patients, and they will have to turn people away. They've canceled all surgeries to use the ORs for available ventilators, but it still won't be enough. She also said she found people in their 40s and 50s who were previously healthy to be on ventilators and having major difficulty breathing because they took Advil. Uh, also, four doctors have had.